Hello and welcome to another video. Previously we have learned how to display data with the Windows app and latest with an analog gauge. This time we will have a look at how to connect the Lambda Shield for Arduino to this OLED display. You will find a link to the model in the description below. We will not get into details on how the display work. We simply let the UHG2 library handle it for us. Check out their wiki on how to use your particular display. To connect this display to the Arduino, we only need four pins. Two for power and two for the I2C serial data bus. We connect the ground, the 5 volt, the serial data bus, and finally the clock. But make sure to check the datasheet of your model before connecting it. On our GitHub page, link in the description below, you find a ready code to use. If you use a different display, you need to change the type in the code yourself, which is very simple. But the recommendation is to stay with the same size, 128 by 64 pixels. If you get an error for missing UHG2 library, just get it from the library manager and upload the code to your Arduino. Here is the result. To the right of the display is status icons of the connected sensor, power and heater. As you can see, the heater icon is flashing as the sensor is warming up, just like the LED. Once the sensor is up to temperature, you see AFR on the top and lambda value on the bottom. Thank you for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more.